Okay, so I just installed the Google Assistant app in my Galaxy Watch and here is it. Once I installed it, it's now asking me to activate the Google Assistant on your watch. Let's see what happens. I'm gonna click get started. To talk to Google Assistant, of course, now I have to open on my phone to activate typical Google. So let's see what happens. Get started. Open on phone to activate, continue on phone. Here is my Galaxy Z Fold 3. It's connecting the Assistant to my watch right now. And hopefully this works because I've been waiting for the Google Assistant on my Samsung Galaxy Watch for quite a while now. There you go. I'm gonna tap on activate. And hopefully that is it. Access Assistant on my watch, agree to voice match. Excellent. Get your personal results, of course I'm in. Talk to your assistant with a button. Excellent, so that's done. So that's now has set up the Google Assistant in my Galaxy Watch here. So let's go try it out. Okay, so now if I long press the button in my Samsung Galaxy Watch, it would still open up Bixby, which is not good. But the good thing is if you go to your settings and then go to advanced features and then go to customize keys and there you have the home key and you have an option press and hold and then you have the option assistant. So now what happens if I press and hold the home key, you're going to have Google Assistant pop up. How's the weather today? Isn't that cool? So that's how now you can set up Google Assistant in your Samsung Galaxy Watch and use all the Google goodness, bring it to your Samsung Galaxy Watch. And this is a great update. So. Thanks Samsung and Google for working on this. And of course you can also use the wake up word, okay Google, how far is Best Buy from here? The first one. Awesome. If you want to see more videos like this, make sure you subscribe. This was a quick video, so hopefully I'll meet you back with a really good long video, but I wanted to post this update so everybody gets how to install the Google Assistant on their watch.